There we go. Why did Cotto let me off? Good right by, by Cotty. Nice jab. Cotty's jab has been sharp. And the right hand sends wow. Cotty down. Now that's a shocker. Right at the end of round one. Cotty's okay. And the end of the round. Now you'll see the right sneak up just inside Cotto, uh, Cotty's left hook. Sneaks just inside. You'll see it here. You gotta don't blink. Oh, it's, it's the, the left, left hand. It's short left. left hand. Sneaks just inside. You'll see it here. You gotta don't blink. Oh, it's, it's the, the left, left hand. It's short left. left hand. That his best bet is to attack that body, that space in between the two elbows with his left hand. It's a good jab there by Claudi. And another. And he follows with a good straight right hand. He also landed several very good stiff jabs. That right hand landed, but a little bit thin from Josh Claude. And he's got, you know what? This is a big round, man. This is the this is his fight. Got it. Claude coming out throwing punches. And Cotto now trying to bang him off. Wow. And he's got, you know what? This is a big round, man. This is the this is his fight. Got it. Claude coming out throwing punches. And Cotto now trying to bang him off. Wow. This is what we expected. The fight to be. Obviously, Claudie knows the, what the butt rule is, and he knows that you got to work that cut. Heads are very close. They almost bang oh, in. Claudie, wow. big work for the left hook. Good combination by Cotto. Wow. I will right, we'll take a look at some of the action here. Early on, it's all Josh Claudie. He's looking to finish the fight here. Cotto's done a good job. After Claudi had a good start to the round. The combination by the champion. The blood streaming down the left side of his face. Now that's a oh, nice combination by Claudi. Another good one by Claudi. Now, this is before what happened in the corner. You'll see that big right hand from Claudi. Northern cut become a real factor in this fight. Good left hand by Cotto and another one. Cotto coming back. Claudi covering Claudio's up. hurt now. Cotto is backing up. Cotto switches to southpaw and goes right back. Wow. Right now, I don't know what is going on with Josh Claudi. I Cotto wonder. Bagging the body. Why is he not spinning out of the corners? It have to do with the knee injury, if there is one. Cotto banging away with a left hand. Now, Claudio's catching a lot of them on his elbows. Oh, that that one got in. got in. Oh, yeah. No doubt about that. As soon as Potty brings that, those gloves down, Cotto opens up. He got through with both. There's got to be a reason why Claudio is not making an effort oh. to get out of this corner. Now Claudio tries to fight back. Claudio is bothered. All right, did you just see, man, this is all Cotto because the round was... Basically all Cotto until the final seconds. Pretty dangerous. Cotto put him right back in the corner and lands a good combination. Cotty's hurt. He looked to be shaky. Now he definitely got his bell rung way back here early in the round by a left hook. Cotty looking very shaky. A good combination with a big left hook by Cotto. Another wow. one. Cotty spent most of that time in his own corner against the ropes. Unable to get out, but right back against the ropes. You know, you wonder if he is injured and is using the ropes to support. And that's where he does his work, man. That's his office. That is Miguel Cotto's office. Claudio got in a right hand uppercut. Claudio landed a straight right. And a combination. Oh, boy. Claudio's got to increase the work rate, though, Sam. You know, he really, and that's a good right hand, but he hasn't really been able to hurt Cotto yet and get real respect out of him. Straight right hand again. After Cotto had a big oh. sixth round, Claudio is having a, a big seventh round. And Cotto has got a, oh, what a Another. shot! Claudio is starting, and Cotto is starting to let his left arm dangle a little bit. 
and he's left a pretty good target for that punch right there. Spitting blood now, he's bleeding inside his mouth. Wow, oh. there's that right up uh, again, slip. he slipped. Uh, All right, let's see what happened in that round. I mean, these rounds are just getting too crazy. One guy will be, oh, there's the, the, the But he caught himself. Oh, oh big right that's hand the best by punch of the fight. That might be the best punch of the fight, including yeah. the knockdown punch. Buddy's punches are straight and landing. On the canvas. But I mean, one guy will just be belaboring the other guy. Fighting the role of the warrior. Wow. But these last two rounds, Tani is big. Cotto turns it around. Oh, my Cotto. Then he backed off. It has been effective. Dead on. Oh, that right hand snapped Cotto's head straight back. You know, I think the question's about Cotto's chin at this point. I think we ought to just put them on the shelf. Final seconds of round 10. A good glory oh. by Cotto. Here's the end of the round now. You can see that there was a good left hook there by Cotto, but not a lot of clean punches in that round from either guy. Both different judges score yeah. fights different ways, you know. And it is a close fight. I mean, there were several rounds where there was no doubt who won them, and there was other rounds where... Now, I'll tell you what. I remember I said this at the end of the eighth round. I have the feeling Claudi is winning this fight. Well, I don't know what he did. That was a good flurry, but Cotto backed off. Sharp jail oh. by, by Cotto. He almost knocked Claudi down again with that same punch. That's twice in this round he tried to get a point taken away from Cotto. They are going absolutely wild here at the Garden. Wow, and they have seen a heck of a fight. Most of those punches missed by Claudi. And this oh. one, and a punch on the break, and that's it. It's over. Wow. Tremendous fight and very puzzling, very puzzling fight. To the winner by split decision from Caguas, Puerto Rico, still WBO, welterweight champion of the world, Miguel.